Okay, this video is um, about creating an array of objects along curves. So the best way to do, in my opinion, is by using MASH, the uh, motion graphics uh, tools for Maya. So um, let's just throw an example. So I'll create a curve. something like that okay then I create a cube something like this move the pivot like this sorry snap to there okay snap to the grid delete the history delete the freeze the transformations okay so we have a curve we have an object, so select the object, go into the Mesh tab, create Mesh. Okay, first thing that Mesh will create is a distribute node, so we don't care about this. We have to add a curve and a uh, Mesh curve. So click on this, add, and then in the outliner, just middle mouse drag the curve into the um, sorry not here but into the curves um, empty space so I'll drag this in here and my object moves at the beginning of the curve and then we have to go back to the distribute node and change the distribution type from linear to initial state. So, and from now on, we can change the values inside the mesh curve or in the mesh distribute or both. So, for example, we can reduce the number of objects to one and then go to the mesh curve tab and and then we can modify all these parameters here so we can um, let's go to the distribute and raise the number of object like this and then go here and then raise the step and as you can see, you can distribute the object along the curve, no problems. And it'll follow the direction if you want, or you can just tell the uh, tell Mesh not to calculate the rotation, and it will not calculate the rotation if you don't need that. You can have equal space between the objects, and you can also tell the uh, c uh, Mesh curve to use the curve length and affect the speed which the speed is basically the distribution of the object like this see so i suggest you to play with mesh which is really easy and super funny to use and that's it pretty much so you can have so many things you can do here Okay, I hope these has been helpful as well and I'll catch you later.